Hey, what is going on everyone? Welcome back to Everyday Technology, and 2019 is finally here. Unless, of course, you're watching this video early. So, in this video, I want to go over the things that I accomplished on this channel over the past year, as well as look forward and look ahead to the things that I hope to accomplish in 2019. So, last year around this time, I made a video similar to this going over my goals for 2018. And one of those goals was to have a company send me a product to review for free. And let me tell you, I have more than enough tech products in that closet right there to review. And I am just so excited and so happy that the companies decided to send me products to review um, because it really helps the channel out. I don't, I don't buy that much tech. So in order to really get the videos out there consistently, I need companies to send me things. And I am really thankful for all the companies that have sent me products this year, as well as set up giveaways for me, which I was not expecting at all. Another goal that I had was to get a 4K camera. And if your monitor or computer can handle it, you can watch this video in 4K because the camera that I have is 4K. I will be coming out with a review for it very soon. I just have not had a lot of time to get used to it yet, and I really want to give you guys an in-depth review. I'm not going to tell you what camera it is yet, because I will leave that for a surprise. Another goal that I had last year was to get a MacBook Pro, and if you can see it, it's right behind me right there. And I just made a review on it, I will leave it linked in the description down below. In that review, there wasn't a whole lot that I disliked about it. I really enjoy using it. It is, of course, a little different from the Windows interface, so that took me a little bit to get used to. But right now, this video is being edited on the MacBook Pro. It's being The audio is being recorded on the MacBook Pro. And overall, I feel that this computer will definitely drive my YouTube channel for the next couple of years. I did make some analytical goals as far as the channel goes, and although we did not meet those goals this year, we did get halfway. One of those goals was to hit 1k subscribers. We got halfway there, we got 500 subscribers, 400 of which were gained in 2018 alone. I'm just so thankful for all you guys who shared my videos and who liked, subscribed, and commented on them. Thank you guys so much. Another goal that I had was to reach 100,000 overall channel views. We actually just hit 50,000 channel views and I'm very confident that we can meet that goal in 2019. As far as channel goals that I would like to see achieved in 2019 is to hit 1k subscribers which was one of last year's channel goals and to also hit 200,000 overall channel views which I think is definitely possible with the way we are growing lately. Another thing that I would like to see achieved in 2019 is just better overall camera shots in my videos. I know that seems a little funny, but I just want to have smoother camera shots and not just do the pans and tilts, but I really want to get into some really dynamic shots and I want to really push my boundaries as far as my cinematography skills go. Now if you have noticed, this is my sixth video uploaded in December of 2019. Yeah, December was a pretty busy month for me and what I was really surprised about was the quality of my videos. And I know most of my videos are pretty high quality, but for uploading a video pretty much twice a week, I was really surprised at how well I was able to keep up the quality. When most YouTubers try to get out two to three videos a week, the quality of their videos goes down because they just can't put that time and effort that they want to into their videos when they are on such a constrained amount of time. And I really wanted to challenge myself, at least in December, to really keep the uploads going and see how far I could push myself. 
and I was really surprised with the results. And I'm pretty sure most of my viewers were as well because the viewership really skyrocketed. Let me know if you wanna see more frequent uploads. I definitely have a ton of products to review in the upcoming months. And I also be coming out with a travel video because I will be traveling in the upcoming year. So drop a like down below if you would like to see more travel videos on the channel. I have my drone, the, the uh, DJI Spark, and I really like flying that. Let me know if you wanna see some cinematic drone videos. All right guys, that's it for my channel goals for 2019. Drop a like down below if you thought they were cool. Comment down below if you have any feedback for me. Also subscribe to the channel if you really, really like my videos. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.